this video today is about finding cool spots wherever you're shooting. Um, for me, I do a lot of city stuff and I do a lot of travel and the number one thing that I like to do is get on Google Maps. It's really, really awesome because it allows me before I hit a city to look and find out what's in that city, um, locations, directions, everything like that. I can pin it and I have it on my phone when I'm driving so I know exactly where to go what to look for then when I get to that city I will actually spend a day just going to those spots um, that makes it better because it allows me to see where the Sun's gonna be at certain parts of the day um, and it allows me to figure out what the best time of day is to get the shots that I'm getting um, and that's very important for me so even in my hometown which is Houston right now I have driven around the city and gone to pretty much all the parking garages like all of them and then I've gone to the top of them and it's cost me a few dollars but go to the top of them and then see what kind of perspective that I get uh, one of my favorite spots is this parking garage it's over here by Minute Maid Park it's right to my right and um, it offers an amazing view unobscured of the unobstructed I should say of the back of downtown Houston so I'm here right now because I got in the 14 to 24 2.8 today on the D850 and I'm excited to see um, how well that lens works with this camera so that is what I'm doing right now as you can see it's taking one right now it's in its silent mode so you can't even hear a click which is pretty awesome um, and then after we do this, we're gonna be walking around and getting some more shots in the city. You'll be seeing all this time-lapse video afterwards, so you can check out, you know, how well the 14 to 28 does, 14 to 24, 2.8 does on the Nikon. So, hope you enjoy the video, and I'll talk to you soon.